Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 23, and this is war number five, and we're going up against an alliance called Exit Tium. I don't know if I said that right, uh, but as usual, I've gone in, I've looked over my paths, seen who I have to fight, and this is who I'm going in here with. Now, I know some of you have watched my rank up video, and you're wondering why you don't see her here. That's because I had not ranked her up at the time that this war took place. I'm catching up on the war videos. All right, so this first fight is gonna be against Silver Surfer. And I remember fighting Silver Surfer. Um, he wrecked me, but I actually was able to eventually get a one shot. This is when he first came into the contest. I got a one shot using Wasp. So needless to say, I am familiar fighting uh, Silver Surfer. Now the danger of course on this path is that they're gonna stack Furies as the fight goes on. Now I could have taken this fight with um, uh, some of my other champions, but I figured let me use Black Widow Clairvoyant who I love uh, and I figured that she could do the job and do it well, and she's sustainable too. So she's she's good with the damage and sustainable. So you see those Furies? See, he's got a stack of five, and now seven just keeps going up, okay? Now, I believe if I fire off a special, it will reset the counters, and it'll stop their um, Fury gen. You know, that's what I call it, a Fury Gen. But you'll notice every time they fire a special off, I lose. You know, it's a very annoying node. Basically, you want to either bring in someone who you can fire their specials off a lot, maybe a power drain, or someone who does a lot of damage, or someone who doesn't really rely on their specials. So you could fight just like you saw me fight. I pretty much ignored the node. Okay, didn't worry about firing specials off to reset the counters, nothing like that. Now, this fight, Tigra is very annoying and I am not practiced enough with her. I got better after this fight, but her animations mess me up. She, she got too much. She's doing too much, guys, too much. All right, so you see here, it looks like it's gonna be a pretty easy one, right? You know, look at that, she's already at half health. All right, and I'm, I'm evading that one. All good, right? So I'm like, all right, I'm in the corner, but look at that, fought out the corner. Boom, got some more bleeds. She's almost done. Hit into her block so I could get away from, you know, the corner a little bit. And then that happened. She dexed me, threw me completely off. Now she parried me. I'm in the corner. My life is gone. Real Nick Fury done come out. I'm like, what in the world? Get away from me. Boom, boom, boom. That was ridiculous. I had to throw that special two to save my life. She was about to wreck me in that corner, guys. All from that single dex that threw me off, got me back in the corner where I was trying to keep away from because I know her specials are vicious and almost got wrecked. If I was in there with anyone else, I probably would have just died. Because keep in mind, she's gonna be building those Furies up. But we got her down and we didn't die. So doing good so far. All right, so now um, this guy here, I'm like, you know what? I think I could take this Terax. Black Widow, yeah, let's see. All right, so with Terax, uh, you basically wanna stay away from him in, uh, in the beginning. You know, while he has this rock field up like that, you know, that's where you see me just backing off, backing off. Now it's gone. Now I go in for the attack. Okay, nullifying stuff. It's a good time. It's a good time. All right, he's trying to get armor ups. He's trying to do all kinds of stuff. It ain't working. He's not going to get nothing. All right, he's getting those uh, furies. But just look at that. Nice, right? But now I'm in uh, the uh, incinerate mode. And so I'm just like, okay, backing off, backing off. Now at this time, I'm like, you know what? I know that I can get that health back 
uh, in perhaps a later fight, but I went and switched over to blood just in case I'd be able to get, you know, it in this one, but just didn't have enough. That would have gotten me a lot of health back, but he didn't have enough health to survive. And uh, she heals based on the damage she does. And if they're already knocked out, she's not doing any damage. So not gonna heal. But I'm like, okay, you know, we got other fights and we'll get her done. All right, now this Nick Fury, I, they, we have people to fight this fight. Mixmaster, I don't wanna deal with it. All right, um, so now uh, section two, and you see that human torch up there? He's gonna be mine. All right, uh, Nick Fury does this fight excellent. Uh, and by the way, the reason that you saw the uh, pull down menu, where you normally don't see it, is because I recorded that previous one on my iPad rather than on the computer like I usually do. Uh, because I was doing something and I was like, ooh, you know, he's free, hold on, I didn't wanna hold anybody up and uh, took that fight. All right, so on this node, you don't want to go in with somebody that has a lot of buffs. That EMP modification thingy, not a good look. But fortunately, I don't need to worry about that with Nick Fury, and he is an excellent counter. Anytime I see Human Torch on that node, I want to take him out with Nick Fury. Only way that I wouldn't is if my Nick Fury was already dead. So now we're on to section two. And you see they didn't put a defender on that first node. But now I got to fight um, Hyperion. Now, here's the thing. I normally go into this fight with Nick Fury when he has the life model decoy still active. But this is the real Nick Fury. I will not survive a special three. So what I'm going to do is add a little insurance. You see it right there. Add that insurance. Boom. Now, I can take a special three. As long as I don't get hit, I can take three special threes. And uh, so we should be fine. Uh, and of course, I'm not going to just go in and, and take the special three because you never know what can happen. Uh, you know, I might get hit. You know, a swipe didn't register or I messed up. Uh, so I'm still going to try to bait it out. And then this time I was like, okay, I got him. And we're done. All right. Uh, I could tell from the way that the AI was playing that they were probably not going to fire off their special. So I just said, all right, never mind. Um, we can take it. Let's just go in, try and do as much damage as possible. All right. Now, as you can see, I was the first one in that section. They cleared out their paths and got that next mini. But now we're on mini boss Island and I usually sit here and wait. And when they, um, say, okay, you know, take this guy out or take this guy out. At this point, we are pretty sure that we've lost the war. And so what we were told was we just need to get that boss down. Deaths no longer matter. Just get it done. So I said, okay. So I'm going in here with Black Widow Clairvoyant, the rage node. She doesn't care. Uh, she will uh, basically nullify any Furies that he gets up. Now, the reason Hulkbuster is on this node, and it's a sneaky one, you do not want to push Hulkbuster to a special two at this point. Uh, and the reason is the node, and you're going to see it right here, uh, because, of course, I did it again. Look at this. Look at all that. The reason that happened, normally Hulkbuster is unblockable for a very short period of time after the um, special two. Basically, if you evade the, um, the special two and block the, the first part of the special two and then block the rest of it, you're good. However, on this one, that unblockable, which is a buff, lasts longer, so it lasts the entire special two. And unless you're good at evading the special two, don't do it. So now I'm fighting back from a deficit. You guys are about to see why I love Black Widow. See, I'm in blood mode. Look at her health just going back up. We took a full special two hit. 
almost took us out. Look at how she looks now. And this is why I chose her, my six star, to take up. Uh, so yeah, love, love Black Widow Clairvoyant. Just look at this. We just slow played it, bait out those special ones. Don't go to the special two again, you know, just bait it out. And that's pretty much it. You know, the indestructible is annoying, uh, but you just don't try to block immediately after it. Just uh, punish it uh, like you normally would. Okay, now at this point, you know, I want to bait out that special one. There we go. And I should have fired off the special two. Why I did not, I'm not going to complain anymore about anything like dropped inputs or anything. But in any case, we got this Hulkbuster down and our health could have been higher but we got her done all right now you think i'm done i'm not done now we've got this dark hawk all right now with dark hawk you don't want to knock him down if you can help it because he's going to get that shield mode and it's just annoying um not a good time not a good time so uh, you want to bait out special ones and uh, just not knock him down. So Nick Fury, not good uh, for this fight. Um, but Black Widow, Clairvoyant can do it. Warlock can do it as well. But I was trying to save Warlock for another fight. All right, so here we go. Things are looking pretty good. I switched over to Poison, get that Poison off of me. Now we're over into uh, Incinerate, all right? And we're gonna try to bait this uh, special one out. Sometimes he likes to act up. As you can see, a little bit annoying. Doesn't want to fire it off. All right, look at this. Just, just, and I don't want to be in the corner because I cannot evade his special one. Uh, um, his uh, heavy attack, rather. All right, so there I evaded his special or blocked his special one. All right, and that's pretty much what I want to do at this point. Okay, now here, I did knock him down. All right, um, but I figured, you know, it was worth it to get some damage in on him, get him done. Uh, and then I remembered that I could parry and just attack while he's parried, and I don't have to worry about that shield mode. So, like, parry, do one, two hits uh, until it's done. Okay. So I was like, okay, we can do this. We can do this, right? So here we go. I'm in blood again. Now that one right there, I did not mean to fire a special one. I thought that I was at a special two, but I wasn't. Uh, so I was just like, oh man, kind of messed me up. Not only that, but since I am running suicides, that I took recoil damage. Now there, I got it, okay? And look at that, help. And then that happened. And I'm just like, seriously? Are you kidding me? Boom. And that's it, really. I'm done. All that good playing. All of that good playing. And I tried to swipe. And see, I was having problems earlier. What I should have done before this fight was to shut down and restart. Because I was having issues already. But I wanted to finish this off. And I paid for it. So... Next time, if I'm having issues in a previous fight, restart the app and then keep going, okay? So now we're having to take this guy out, uh, finish him off with uh, Warlock. And again, stubborn, I did not, um, you know, restart the game, okay? But it is what it is. I I'll, I'll learn. I'll learn eventually. I'll learn. Uh, so we finished him off. And now... We've got this Sorcerer Supreme. And this node, I don't like this node. And for her, it's a specifically or, or particularly annoying. All right, she's got Enhanced Special 2, but that improved power gain is so annoying. But of course, Warlock can handle power gain. He has a little bit of power control, um, especially on a special one when they're infected. So I'm thinking, all right, I should be able to do this. So the first thing I want to do is get the infections up, right? So I'm parrying, parrying, all right, boom. 
infected. Now, I go in for the attack. All right, she fires that off. You know, it's doing some damage. I try to evade the last one. All right, and there she's infected. All right, boom, boom, boom. She does a heavy attack. Uh, and I'm used to just going in hard, but for some reason, uh, I was a little off uh, when I was fighting her this time. Um, it might have been because, you know, I was a little upset over what happened uh, just a little bit before this. Uh, but no, not me. I don't I don't get tilted or anything like that. And then that happened. And I'm just like, are, are, are you kidding me? All right. So not good to play when you're upset. And just look at that damage. So much damage into my block. And then it was over. And I'm just like, I'm so glad we already knew we were going to lose this one. Because I would have been so upset at my performance. All right. So here, I've been getting potions, you know, one at a time, slowly. Um, and it doesn't make any sense to heal him up past that, really. Uh, but this is the real Nick Fury. So my strategy going in here is to just go all in. Not even playing around. Let's just go all in. You know, get those bleeds and uh, take her down. Okay. Uh, we're getting hit a little bit. But then again, maybe not. Uh, so down she went. Pretty quick, pretty easy finish. Uh, honestly, he might have been able to take her out by himself. Um, but I wasn't going to risk it. All right. So that, I believe, is all the fights that I participated in in this war. I cleared the left side, as you saw. Uh, and then uh, I think Big Blue and, and some others uh, cleared the right side and the boss. And uh, so uh, we pretty much know how this war ended, but little ha let's have a little intermission and we'll be back and you will find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, as predicted, we lost this war. Um, good job, exit team. Uh, but that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.